Hey guys, welcome back to Cheesy Crafts. Today I am going to be showing you how to make this beautiful You Stole My Heart card. Um, the initial intent of this card was to for Valentine's Day, but I just never got around to editing the video and um, you know doing the voiceover and I kind of almost didn't want to do it you know and just keep it like a, as a lost video but then I was like why not and you know you could tell somebody you love them every other day of the year it doesn't have to be just for Valentine's Day um, and so this card came about um, with the intent for Valentine's Day but like I said um, it could be as an anniversary card or it could just be a just because I'm sure everybody loves to you know receive something as a just because they love you so uh, so let me get stop blabbering and let's get to the card I ended up using like a baby blue cardstock that I just had in my stash and the second layer of the paper I know that that's a specialty paper from stamping up and I think it was a kit or a pack because it came with nothing but a Valentine's Day theme um, and it's not new I know it's been a while for at least I've had it for a year and just now got to using it but I know it's old it's an old specialty paper and honestly I do not know if it has been discounted or not so that's kind of like what I'm using because it has and I try to give you a close-up but it was just too fast um, it has like a blue and red and pink hearts on it and so I wanted to tie the colors together now I'm using this stamp set it's from uh, Unity Stamp Company and this is one of their girls I am not sure of the name um, this is one of the stamp sets that I've told you guys I'm just very fortunate and lucky to have a crafty neighbor that literally lives down the street and this is one of her stamp sets that I borrowed um, and when we just got together you guys know we just stamp a bunch of images and so I just fell in love with her uh, for her skin I ended up using E00 which is a cotton pearl color and for her dress I ended up using cad cadmium I cannot pronounce it cadmium red which is R27 and these are Copic markers and then for her hair I ended up using E23 which is hazelnut and um for because when I looked at the image I feel like she's looking up at the sky so <laughs> at least that's kind of like what I thought when I saw the stamped um the stamp set and so I wanted to give her like a baby blue background so once I'm done coloring her and cutting her like to size uh, which is off camera of course uh, with the B00, B00, which is a frost blue, I am going to give her some shade to the image. And I am just going to be doing that all the way around. And making sort of like a blue, like a sky background to her. I am also um, going to take the color N00 which is like a soft gray and I wanted to use that as like a blending color uh, for the blue so that you know the blue is not like overpowering which is not because it's like a really soft blue but I don't know I just thought like it needed something else so I just came in with that soft um, gray and I mixed um, blended them together and that's kind of like what's gonna give her the background and 
and before I adhere it I am going to be using um, this foam tape and I really loved um, this foam tape you guys have seen my previous videos where I've been using the foam squares but I don't know this tape just made it more sturdier and um, made it pop differently than the I mean I'm still gonna use the foam squares I still have some obviously but this was my first time using this type of tape and I think it made a difference I don't know I really like it um, like I said it was more sturdier uh, so now I am just going to adhere that and I don't show it on camera but I'm just gonna cut it um, around and adhering those two together and then off camera is when I'm gonna trim the red cardstock um, now before I adhere these two together I am going to be using um, the sentiment that says you stole my heart and once again I borrowed this stamp this ink pad from my neighbor Miss Melissa I think it's a color box in chalk red I'm not sure um, of the name of it because like again you guys like I borrowed <laughs> I borrowed it so uh, just stamped it and like I said it says you stole my heart in the color red and now I am ready to put them together now to finish the card I am going to use um, the, uh, like sequin 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 uh, four of them and I'm just kind of placing them I used four like literally four because I'm getting used to the idea of knowing where to place sequins I don't know I struggle with that if you guys struggle let me know because I know I'm not the only person that has no idea how to properly place sequin but anyways I just ended up using four in random spots in front of the car just where I thought it would look good and I am just literally I took the lid off my matte glue and just dipped them in there and then placed them on the card and really that's going to complete a project or I say project for every single thing but that's going to complete our card um, I hope that you guys enjoyed I'm going to link the name of the stamp set below in the description box and like I said, it was meant for Valentine's Day, but every day is a good day to tell somebody that they stole their heart and that you love them. So I hope you like it, and please don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you soon. Thanks. Bye.